comment. They all are present here. I think it is my proud privilege to be with you today at this August gathering and along with me, my Chief Secretary, Mr. Divedi, Manisha Shinha, Additional Secretary, Department of Economic Advisors, appears, Shonali Sen Gupta, CGM Reserve Bank, Chanchal Shortar, Advisor, Department of Economic Affairs, and others. It's very, it's our great pleasure to host this in Canada. I'm so happy. Because we just end of this November, end of this year, we organized International Film Festival where 76 countries they participated. And every DGBS means Global Business Summit. 46 countries. They also participated in our program. We are very happy. All the important industry, all the important uh, the economic sector, they are working here. And I have seen your agenda, but I don't want to just discuss into in detail because the, you have to discuss into your group meeting, the working group meeting. That's why I don't want to disturb, uh, take so much time. But I think I welcome the guests because we think the guests are guests of God. We feel you as our family member. And your family is our family. The world became a sweet family. And wherever I go, we remember whether where the mind is without fear and the head is held high. And where the world has not been broken up into fragments by narrow domestic walls. Always we remember Ravindra Tegar and Nobel Lawrence. You have seen Mother Teresa's work also, she is also from Calcutta. I went to Vatican when she was declared as a saint. I welcome all of you, especially these. What I have seen that your main thing is the digital financial inclusion and small medium enterprise finance and also women economic empowerment is a major focus. I believe that without the development of the people, this world cannot be, cannot develop. And our government, whatever we are doing, we are doing it in our human face. You know, India is a big country. There are so many languages, so many caste, creed, community. But we are united because of our constitution. Unity is our state and divide is all. There are so many democratic government, it's a big democratic country. Government of India is a different political parties or is a different political parties. So every political parties, when they do the development work, it is their decision making, it is their uh, mission, vision, action, whatever you say. This time, 19 countries and the European countries. They are participating in this. And I don't want to mention the name. These are big, big countries. G20. It's a big, big world. I think for what we have done, it is my third term. And I worked as a parliamentarian seven times. And also I worked as a, a four-five central government ministry, ministry also earlier. But I fought with a political party with a leftist ideology. But after 34 years they are defeated. And then after that we are in power. This is the third term. After we came in power, I have seen so many borrowing, so many lending, so many things. No development, nothing, no economic growth. Even the development system was totally, it was collapsed. But in our time, I can proudly say, though the COVID took place, two years, every country faced that situation. We also. But our state GDP has grown by four times. 
और कैपिटल एक्सपेंडिचर बाय सेवन टाइम्स और ओन स्टेट रेवेन्यू कलेक्शन बाय फोर टाइम्स एंड वी हैव बीन एबल टू क्रिएट ट्वेल्व मिलियन जॉब्स व्हाट एवरीवन इज लूजिंग वी आर गेनिंग बिकॉज वी गेव मोर पॉवर टू वीमेन द सेल सेल ग्रुप द फार्मर्स द आर्टिजन the students in our state in different states they have their different program in my state msme sector what to give the priority to employment to create the employment generation we are number 1 in india msme sector and this because this new billion jobs created because of this msme sector and our unemployment growth when somewhere somewhere it is decreased increased 40% we have decreased and our poverty also decreased 40% now we give free food to the people what do we are fighting against hunger hunger we have to see in our women face the human face we know the human face a government cannot work our social security is the main security for the people and we build the government of the people by the people for the people and that's why we give free food to the people free education scholarship for all the girl child and we have got i'm proud to say united nations public award first prize for the girl child scheme because all the girl child education is free the students we give cycles bicycles we give smartphone we give books school bags even the shoes the free education free treatment in hospital even if you go for cardiac attack or the kidney transplantation all are free so education free food free scholarship it may be minorities it may be christians it may be hindu it may be muslims all my girl child from school level to college level to university level all their education they are getting scholarship even on other caste we to give the women empowerment we give the cash money through bank digitization direct benefit system all the family members all the women members who are not working every family we are giving so women they are very very proud that today they are not asking anything from anywhere you see 1.5 billion us dollars we spend for only women to give this largest program of the world which combines digital financial inclusion and the cross and the cross cutting issues of significance of women in the inclusion agenda and sme sme functioning we are the top performers more than 51. 44 billion us dollars credit has been given to them last 7 years huge boost for employment generation this sector of course it helps us and we have another women women empowerment group that is self help group 1.2 million self help group have been formed and they are working in the field self service system government provide money government provide credit and government provide them the place in different areas but all benefit benefits are transferred directly from the treasury of bank account of the beneficiary so i can proudly say that our government have got e governance award first prize award even i have a i will not take more time but i can say 
we started a new program since three years. It is sometimes the people they cannot go to somewhere. The where they will go for caste certificate, where they will go for food. If they have any problem, we organize in every area the camps where officers are taking place. They are sitting there with all forms and all skills. If somebody cannot write, they will help that writing also to full to full fill up their forms also. This program is called Government is at your doorsteps. Instead of they are coming to the outside, we are searching the people who are there, who are not getting any help. And you will be happy to know, Government of India, we have got Devi Puri started the first prize for that also. It is absolutely, it is also digitized totally. Digital India Award. So I am very happy that in every sector from farmers to artisans to women to students to youth to poor people for transgenders or to ready area society or to there are so many groups who are really who were under poverty. Now they became self-sufficient and we want to see our country is also self-sufficient and my world also it should be self-sufficient. I don't discriminate on my country and your country. When we work together, we feel it is our motherland. All the world is our motherland. I, with this word, I thank you very much for giving me this patient hearing. And also, please enjoy Calcutta. I think you will like it. Opposite of the convention center, there is an eco park. It was also my idea. You have seen the Hyde Park in UK. But see the eco park, how we have organized. Even all seven wonders are there also. So you can see your motherland also from there, you can search. And next to this building also, we have the Mother Box Museum. There also you can see so many people from all over the world. And I will request you to visit Calcutta again and again. And we have deep sea, deep forest, and Bay of Bengal. Royal Bengal Tiger, what not? We are, from religious point of view, Swami Vivekananda, Ramakrishna Paramahansa Dev, from cultural point of view, Rabindranath Tegat, Nazrul Islam, to so many, from our artistic point of view, Bengal is the cultural capital of India. Even folk song to English song. Every team, every reading, every painting, you can get some lyrics. And they, that lyrics give us the strength for the future, for the fighting spirit, and for the future of Bengal. And you feel that Bengal, why important? Just one point. It is the gateway of Northeastern region. And it is the gateway of Bangladesh, Nepal, and Bhutan. And gateway of Thailand, even Myanmar, Thailand from here, only it takes two hours time by flight. Bangladesh half an hour. Bhutan also half an hour. Nepal also half an hour. Singapore also two and half hour. So it is gateway of the northeastern region and the eastern region, so many. So it's a very important state. So please come, please visit my country, visit my state, and visit the people. We'll be very happy. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. And I convey my greetings to all of you. Happy New Year. And all of your family members. That right. please take care of your health. We want safe and sound journey. With this word, I say thank you.